Thanks for logging on to MyFoxHurricane.com. Still watching very quiet conditions across the Gulf of Mexico down into the Caribbean. You're seeing that dry Saharan air working its way through the Caribbean. So as you watch these tropical waves work their way towards the west, you're just not seeing much in the way of any convection with these. A few other weak tropical waves further out into the Atlantic, but we just continue to watch more of that dry air coming off the African coastline. Of course, it's very typical this time of the year that we see loads of that dry Saharan air, that dust working its way off the coastline. Now, one area that we've been watching for a couple of days, this is at Invest 94. Uh, if you look at this, not much to speak of. Center somewhere in here, you're seeing some convection with this all being sort of displaced to the east and the southeast of the center. Now, models just continue to persist and say that conditions are going to become more favorable over the next few days, where we may actually see this system trying to acquire some of those tropical characteristics or maybe even subtropical characteristics. And so we may see some development over the next couple of days or at least over the say the next four to five days. But as it works its way to the south, it gains some of those characteristics and then it's going to quickly start to turn and make its way back towards the north. As it does so, it moves over those cooler waters. So if anything were to happen with this, it's going to be fairly short lived. Watch the Fox model as we go through the days. Here we are showing it uh, developing a little bit more. And then there is that move working its way to the north as we head into the weekend and into the first part of next week. So again, if we see something it's probably going to be over the next few days and then it's only going to have a day or two where it could actually do something before it moves over some cooler waters. We'll keep you updated right here on myfoxhurricane.com.